Hello everyone, nice to see you again. I am RK. In this video, let's see how to change our Linux shell. Let's open our terminal. In terminal, everything that we entered will be executed by shell and displays the output. Shell is like themes in smartphone. Each theme has some extra features like some themes have live wallpaper and some themes have some more features. Like that each shell has some each features. The default shell in my Ubuntu machine is bash. Here you can see but I need to change the Linux shell to some other. So for that, let's see how many shells that we have in default. For that, we need to read a file is shells. The file is in etc folder. These are the shells that we have in default. SH, bash, rbash and dash. We can simply change the shell by entering the, the shell name or file name. Here the shell is bin slash sh, simply entered sh so I can switch to sh shell. Here you can see this sh shell only has the dollar sign. Now location place or the user or host machine name. To exit it just type exit. And we have r bash and dash. Dash is also looks similar to sh. Here you can see that. But I need something new. First, let's exit of it. Let's clear the screen. First, we need to update. We need a permission. So, sudo. Entering double exclamatory, it means I need the previous command to enter here. Here you can see. Here we need to type the password. After that, let's clear the screen. Let's search if there is any shell with the name of CSH. Here we have lots of things for CSH. Here is the SH shell and these are their dependencies. Here we are going to install sudo apt install zsh and auto suggestions. ZSH auto suggestions and and syntax highlighting ZSH syntax highlighting now click enter here we need to type the password here ZSH is installed Let's check if the shell is in the file. Here you can see that. Let's change to ZSH. Here you will get the screen like this when you enter the ZSH for first time. Here we are going to use this option. So we need to enter 2. Here we got a different thing. Let's clear the screen. Here we list all the files in our home directory. Here these three files are related to ZSH. Here the ZSH. Not selected permanently. When you close the terminal or restart your machine, you will lose the shell. To make it permanent, you need to change your current login shell. For that, enter chsh. Here you need to type the password. Here you can see that our current login shell has been bash. I am going to change it for zsh. Here our login shell is changed but still we are in the same shell. If we restart our machine, our login shell will be changed from bash to zsh. Let's check it. Yeah, our login shell is changed. Let's 
restart our machine. Let's open our terminal. Here, the screen is different. Here you can see that our current cell is changed to ZSH. Yeah. Let's if you don't like the ZSH cell and revert back to your default shell you can use the same command change shell chsh to change back to your default shell i customized my chsh shell here it looks different if you need a style like this you need to edit this file this file is in your home directory and by default you doesn't have these contents i just added these if you need this file, don't worry, I uploaded this file in the GitHub and the link for the GitHub is in the description. You can download it and paste it here. And after that, just make a restart. You will get the style like this. So that's it guys. If you have any doubts, ask me in the comment section. I will try to clear it. See you in the next video. Bye.